Welcome, Alex Coons, Hot Tongue Pizza. We got a very quick, very easy, plant-based magic recipe for shiitake bacon. Three simple ingredients, four including the mushrooms. Let's get to it, all right? Avocado oil, put that into the shiitakes. We're gonna mix that around. Spread these out. All right, I'm gonna throw this in the oven at 520 degrees for, we're gonna start at 10 minutes. The key here is depending on the um, size of the shiitake, they're all gonna cook a little different. I slice them pretty thin. That's the trick about that. That thin, get some nice big shiitakes, but you want them thin. Uh, we're gonna start at 10 minutes. We're gonna continue to flip. It's usually around 15 minutes, but it's one of those things that doesn't ever it never has an exact time. So you always want to keep an eye on them because within 30 seconds, your shiitake bacon will burn. So we're going to start with 10 minutes. All right, there we go, 10 minutes. So what we're going to do is just flip these around, spread them out. Then another thing to talk about is if you're going to rebake them or put them in something, you could probably call these done because they crisp up if they're twice baked. But you can also make these really crispy. Like this is like a little floppy. There's not much crisp to it. We're gonna get these real crispy. So I'm gonna throw them in for another five minutes. But they smell really good right now. All right. Five minutes later. Okay, you can see it's smoking. It's curled up a little bit. Now what you can do is you can get it even crispier. Like it will turn black. It will get really crispy and almost have that same crunchy bacon flavor. I would, I would use it here. This is where I would stop. I'd put this in salads. I'm gonna put this on pizza. The only other thing is you, you wanna just let it sit and dry out a little bit and then it's ready to eat. You can put it on a sandwich, whatever you, Whatever you want, whatever your heart desires, but it smells bomb. It tastes great. It's crunchy. It's simple. I hope you enjoy. If you're interested in stealing this recipe like I did for Hot Tongue, you can click the link in the bottom, steal this recipe. Kind of has my ethos on reworking, remixing, taking what you can and making it your own. Check out How to Steal a Recipe. Thanks for watching. Later.